And y'all don't know that I'm a soldier I always felt like I'm a loner When everybody thinks they know ya And y'all don't even know I own ya And now I'm ready taking over Cause every day I'm getting closer Just look at everything I'll show ya I'm a yes, 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 my friends. Hey, you already know what time it is. You know it's Pierre Nicholson, your favorite realtor down here in beautiful South Florida, man. Hey, look, come on, man. You know I'm giving you the goods, okay? Hey, listen, I'm here at a beautiful property in North Palm Beach, man. Hey, before I say anything else, come on, man. Hey, take a look. Take a look. Kaboom! Beautiful. And guess when it was built? 2015. This whole community was built by Toll Brothers, man. Hey, guess what? It's on the water. Hey, it's over 10,000 square feet in total, man. Can you handle that? Come on, man. Beautiful, man. I know you like, I like your shirt. This is my shirt. Hey, don't play yourself, man. Go in the description. Come on, South Florida living. Get your merch. Everybody asks me if I got merch. I got merch. And I got more shirts. Like, I'm gonna sell my own clothing line, man. Big up Sarah Lux. Go in the description. Click on her luxury brand, man. We got a little partnership going on together. She made some shirts that people actually want to wear. Okay, I'm getting a lot of compliments on it. You know, for that, you're free here for the house. <laughs> All right, man. <laughs> hey, let's get back into it, man. Kaboom. Okay, Pierre, what is it now? <laughs> hey, before we get into that, man, come on, man. I apologize. Hey, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. So, <clears throat> <laughs> so you can be notified every time I drop a new video, man. I'm choked up on, like, excitement. Hey, we're in a beautiful community in North Palm Beach, man. Very quiet. I'm the loudest thing here. Trust me. Hey, take a look. We back to it. Come on. We back to it. Get back to it. Kaboom. Okay, hey, let me give you the stats real quick. Okay, beautiful. All right, hey, look, man, we're looking at a seven bedroom, seven full baths, two half baths, right? Beautiful, man. A total of seven and a half, seven and two half baths. Okay, seven bedrooms, man. Over 10,000 square feet. Hey, let me give you the exact number, man 10,865 square feet right on the ac though is 7923 square feet beautiful construction out here man hey listen the original builder of this area is toll brothers so you know the craftsmanship and quality is next to none okay and the person that lived here come on man she lived here part-time so the place is basically looked like it was built in 2020 2021 it's immaculately done and kept up like kept up man okay Let's walk in. How much is it, Pierre? Hey, it's going for even 13 million. Come on, man. You know that's a deal. Hey, look at the look at the Spanish towel on the roof. Hey, look at the gray palette. Let's, let's walk up, man. Come on, right? Look at look look at the landscaping beds. Come on, man. Look how it's done. Three car split garage. Look at the palm trees. Plus we on the water, man. Hey, you got a four jet ski lift. You could put a 40, 60 footer easy. Hey, I got my, I got my friend and she's the plug man. Very wonderful person, man. I told you I'm plugged up, man. Everywhere. I'm like literally the whole South Florida. Okay. Hey, let's walk. <laughs> hey, let's continue walking, man. Okay. Beautiful, man. Look at the, look at the tile in front of the house. Right? Look at the how they treat in front of the garage. Right? Beautiful, man. It's that orange spill texture. You got cameras everywhere. Look at the window treatment. So this is like a modern Mediterranean type vibe. Let's walk, let's walk, let's walk in closer. Right, look look up here. Nice. Alright, let's take a, a closer walk in. Beautiful. Okay. Beautiful. Here go my friend right here. How you doing? <laughs> Do fabulous, right? <laughs> right? Um, I love the inlays right here in the foyer, right? And beautiful, like I was two tone. And I was talking to Anne. She said, This is that absolute marble, which means when you see it, you're gonna love it absolutely. Okay? 
Beautiful, man. Come on, man. This is that music as I walk in. And looking at these double high ceilings. Look at that circular tray ceiling with a crown molding, man. And look at that beautiful light fixtures with the balconies beside it. Open so it looks more open. I don't know where to go, left or right. Somebody please tell me something. Okay, go to the left first. Okay, I don't want to go to the master first. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to go right here. This is the office. Beautiful. I'm loving the plantation shutters. Very cool fan. Right? Very spacious, man. You can keep going into the room. Okay, I'm not going to the master yet. Right? Here go a closet. So technically, technically this is a room, but they're using this as a as a as an AV closet. Technically, this is a bedroom, right? Oh, well. Yeah, I got a closet. Well, there's seven bedrooms. Yeah, most definitely. I'm, I'm gonna leave, I'm gonna leave that master for last. Cause there's one upstairs too, right? Okay. Okay. There's two ma hey look, when you got two master suite, you know the house is sweet. Let's continue, man. Right? Nice. How you doing my friend? What's your name? Alyssa, there go Alyssa right there. Welcome. Say, welcome, man. And we feeling very welcome, okay? Beautiful limestone right here, columns, right? And here goes, this is like a butler's pantry or like a bar area, like right? A wet bar. It's a wet bar slash, it, you know, it's right beside the kitchen. It's very nice. And people, please look at the texture, man. So it's, it's almost like an alligator. Yeah. Uh, alligator yeah. quartz? Can yeah. we say that? Yeah. Yeah. Can, we say, <laughs> can we say alligator quartz? Look at this. Come on, I've never seen anything like this. Come on, man, you guys know I drop a million property tours. Have you ever seen alligator quartz? Comment down below, man. Let's continue. I'm loving how the inlays is helping separate in the room space. Let's continue, man. Beautiful circular mosaic over this eating area right here. Done nice. Bay, you got a bay window overlooking the, the backyard. We're gonna get to that. We're in beautiful sunny South Florida wintertime. It's different down here. It's really summer all year, right? Look at this. I'm loving the cove lighting underneath the upper cabinets. Glass cabinets with a crown molding. Come on, man, don't play yourself, man. Hey, I'm gonna make an offer after I finish this tour. Look at this, beautiful. You got your beverage fridge, you got your wine fridge, you got your undermount sink. I'm loving the upper cabinets. Come on, man. Who said it's soft clothes? Don't play yourself. Dovetail too, soft clothes. I'm loving the wallpaper. Let's continue into the kitchen, right? Beautiful, wow. I, look, I feel so much discomfort. I'm like, I'm all over the place, man, because this place is that nice, okay? Big oversized island with two sinks. Hey, man, get out of here. And I'm loving the pantry with the pullouts, right? Beautiful, look at that, man. So no more like opening a regular pantry and try to dig in the back, you just pull it out. And I like the fact they got this right here. So if the door's not all the way open, it's not scraping your doors on the inside, man. Trust me. Hey, for those of you that know that type of vibe, say amen. Because you got a lot of people that got the pullouts, but the, when you open the door, it's like a line there because they don't got the bumpers to secure the door, right? Beautiful, man. Hey, when this, when this, the, the, when the owner, um, Bought the place, man, like she fully upgraded everything. Look at the crown molding. And guess what? She didn't, she's not leaving the area. According to Anne, she's moving across the water. There's an opportunity to get even something, even that much more. Come on, man. And look, I, I can't imagine what, like, what she could be leaving here and going to. It is crazy, right? This place is that nice. Look at this. And look at the window down here. So you're overlooking the outside. You, you, you're on gas. Right, you got two sinks undermounted, right? You got your mechanical goosenecks. It's really like this, but you know, they, they're doing it differently, so I'm gonna leave it to how they did it. You got your mechanical goosenecks, gooseneck faucet, right? You got your dishwasher. Come on, everything is dovetail and soft clothes. Don't play yourself. York, Yorktown cabinets. Okay, a lot of people don't understand the cabinets, right? You got sub zero fridges, sub zero fridge. Right, and look at the living space. Beautiful with the copper ceiling, and it got such a nice little hint of green. You know, green is a very lucky color, especially in the Eastern culture, okay? Beautiful copper ceilings with the crown molding, plantation shutters. I'm loving how the absolute marble come up to the fireplace, which is making me love it absolutely. All right, beautiful. And this fireplace, you're gonna use probably really like two or three times out of the year. And look at the, the windows in here, how it's just naturally illuminated, taking advantage of because this, this house is facing eastern, so it got western exposure in the backyard, so that light's gonna come in here and just illuminate the place that much more beautifully. Okay, let's continue, man. Hey, I'm seeing signs that this house got central vac, 
vacuum, all right, which is the central vacuum is usually located in the garage, okay? Y'all feeling the vibes, man, and let's continue. So we're walking up to the cabana bathroom, and this house got a special dog door. You seen it? And look, the dog even has a little paint on the, the top of the door, man. So the dog is living in luxury. So if you're into pets, into luxury, right? I'm loving the, the, the wood shelvings in the, um, in the closet, and this door is pocketed. I know the average pocket door costs around $1,500, so you know she didn't spare no expense. Uh, upgrading this, right? Here goes the cabana bathroom looking nice, right? And they obscure the door. We're not gonna go up there yet. Come on, man. We can't go outside yet. We gotta see the, we have to see like the lit, the dining room and, hey, over 10,000 square feet in total, man. Come on, man. We're nowhere near close to finishing. Hey, look at this, man. Look at the finishings. Look at the touches. Look at the lighting in the cabinets. Okay, I actually highlights for fine china. That's what you're gonna be doing. And look at the, come on, man. Look at the handles. It's literally jewelry, man. You got diamonds, man. Okay, beautiful. So this table right here seats about 10. Be big, beautiful tray ceiling. Big AC supply line. So you're definitely cool when you're eating your, you know, when you're eating your food, right? And I, I'm kind of seeing a little vision where, you know, during some entertainment times, you can clear this off, put the food up here, okay? And it's a party, man. Most definitely, let's walk in, man. I like how the towel transitions to this black and white towel, man, it's still marble, right? Look at this, plantation shutter, plantation shutter, right? Nice, big, beautiful, tall doors, high ceilings, right? I'm loving the, the washer and dryer, undermount sink. This looks like quartz, gooseneck faucet. You got your rack, which is absolutely outstanding. Come on, man. Hey, this got this got storage for days. Hey, if you can't if you can't find space, you got too much stuff, man. Over ten thousand square feet. Trust me, man. You gotta consolidate or or you know give goodwill a shout. And let's continue over here. Wow. Hey, look at the garage. Hey, the garage is sealed in epoxy, right? This house is on a tank heater. I'm gonna go ahead and say right now, this house is probably like four zones, right? So this is a, it's a three car split garage. This side has a two car. The next side has a one car. This has access to the outside. Let me see if I can open this up real quick, right? So you get, oh, I, come on, man. You have a generator on gas out here, man. This is absolutely beautiful, man. Big privacy hedges. Right? Come on, man. They got cameras all over the place so nobody can run up. Nobody can just come on now so you know the vibes, right? Let me log this back. Right? We, there go the electrical panel. And look how high the ceilings are. You could definitely put a garage lift in here. You could definitely put a garage lift in here. I don't know if it will hit this. If you can, you can reconfigure it. And man, come on, man. It, it, but if the garage lift can kind of shimmy through these two, Man, you got yourself a party, man, because in here is tall, big, high ceilings, man. So you can turn the six car, you can turn a three car to a six car garage, right? Electrical panels, okay? And look at the essential vac. That's a big boy central vac, man. New tone, don't play yourself, man. That's the big boy, okay? So that's over 10,000 square feet, man. You can't have the small central vac, right? Sealing epoxy floors with a terrazzo type look, and it got the texture. Come on, man, Keep, look. Did this house look like it was built in 2015? Come on, right down below, let me know. This is pocketed. You know she didn't spend no money on the upgrades, man. Let's continue, right? Beautiful. Let's go this way, right? I'm loving the big, like, Mediterranean type entrance, man. Come on, I'm getting goosebumps. I'm loving the inlays to separate the space. Let's go to the right real quick. Okay, here go another closet. Hey, you got space for days. Come on, man, you got so much space. It is crazy, right? Let's, let's, let's walk in. Wow. So they got in here, they got some wine and alcohol in here. So, man, you can fit a lot in there. Like, you got so much space, you're gonna need somebody to help you organize how you're gonna use the space. Okay, beautiful. This, this is why I said it's space flossing. Right, here go the elevator. And I love how they continue that absolute marble inside the elevator and they literally just put molding everywhere. Okay, look at this. Beautiful on the ceiling, right? 
So this property does have an elevator for those of you that love a two-story house but don't really want to walk upstairs anymore. You got an elevator, man. All right? I'm loving the bathroom. I love how it has a little separation in there for the for the toilet and the sink. Right? You got this black marble under my own sink with a black sink. Nice job. You got this big frameless mirror from vanity to ceiling height, touching the crown, okay, like it's supposed to, right? And you got the light fixtures that's embedded in the glass, okay? I'm loving it, man. Hey, you got your light, you got your vent, right? Very spacious bathroom. Well, look at this. They even crowned the like the little separations. They like she made like it's a detail. She even crowned the snap crowned. Put molding on the separations, man. So you already know, like they, they she, she, look, she watched every little detail, right? Plantation shutters, so you know if you're going to like a suite. This is not the master suite. This is not even the second master suite. This is just a regular bedroom in this house, and it has a little foyer type entrance going to it, so you know it's special already. And let's continue. I like how it travels from the absolute to the carpet. Right, beautiful, big, look, that's a king size bed. So I'm giving you context of how big the room is. Big, tall, high ceilings, right? Let's continue, man. Beautiful. Right, here go the closet. You got two, uh, double door, right? And I'll go ahead and say this is a walk-in closet, man. Look at this. This is a walk-in closet. Let me see if I can turn on the light. Look at that, beautiful, right? Yeah, this is a walk-in closet. And guess what? <laughs> if you put built-ins in this closet, it, man, you can maximize the space even that much more, okay? Let's walk into the bathroom. This is a regular bedroom in this house, right? You got a TV in your bathroom. Don't play yourself, man. I told you this is a regular place. And I'm loving the stone. Come on, man. I love the stone in this bathroom. Under mount sink, right? Big frame mirror with the light picture on the top embedded in the mirror. You got pocket doors everywhere. It's like pocket doors was just given away and she just got a whole bunch, okay? Come on, that's not cheap. 15, 15, on the average 1500 to install a pocket door, man. She got them in here like it's regular doors, right? You got your sunken shower with the river stone on the bottom, plus a little seating area and a niche, right? I'm a big boy, so I can't really see. You eat me, that. <laughs> Maybe I can fit a little vibes there, you know what I'm saying? If I had to, right? This is nice, man. And even the crown molding in the bathroom, look at that, AC supply light vent. The whole nine. Let's continue, man. Hey, we got a lot to see. This is gonna be a long tour, man. Right? Let's go this way. Beautiful. Let's check, let's check out our master suite over here real quick. Look, you got the piano over here playing by itself. Look at that. Maybe it's negotiable, maybe it's not. We'll find out. Look at my friend Ann over there. there. There she go. She's kind of busy. And let's go into the first bed, first master bedroom, let's go into it, man. They got a little foyer type vibes, right? They got the inlay separating space. They continue the absolute marble into the bedroom. Let's go. Beautiful, look at this. This is crazy. And you know, it connects here to the office, which is, to me, is like another bedroom because you got the closet right there. Technically, it's a bedroom, right? Let's go this way. Wow. So you are into the bedroom, which really walks into a foyer. Right? Beautiful, I'm loving the crown. <laughs> I'm loving the crown in the ceiling. Right, you got your plantations. So you're in a foyer right now. Let's go to the left. Wow, I am like smitten right now. I'm loving the inlays in the ground, right? Okay, you got, you got a toilet right here with the bidet, right? I'm loving the wallpaper. Hey, this person, like she really picked, her touches are second to none. I, I, I'm wondering if she was an interior designer herself, man, because she really knows what she was doing. Look at the texture of the wallpaper, man. Hey, this is done to taste, and she put the molding on the entrance. She didn't have to do that, but because she knows what she's doing, of course it's done to perfection. Look at this. All right, let's continue. Beautiful, look at this. This, this is the master bedroom downstairs, so if, you need, so if you didn't want to go upstairs, you can have a master bedroom downstairs. They do have one upstairs, though, right? Beautiful, man. I'm loving the light fixtures, right? I'm loving the stone, right? Two sinks and a separated. Hello? You hear that echo? Come on, man. She got columns in here, like, for no reason, man. Look at that. But it's looking good. It is a reason. It's for beautification. 
Right, come on man, somebody ask if it's, if it's dovetail, yes it is. Is it soft clothes, don't play yourself, right? And look at the handles, man. Come on man, it's done, t and the crown molding, it is done tastefully. You got sun and shower in here with the river stones on the bottom, right? Nice shower head, big spawn niche. They're going nice big seat with the plantation shutter in the bathroom. Guess what? Don't play yourself. You can even open it up if you want that much. If you want to give somebody a show. <laughs> if you want to give your neighbors a show. But guess what? They got an easement beside your house. So it's that much wider. So you and your neighbors are not on top of each other. Okay? So that's the plus, man. We're here in North Palm Beach County. Hey, this property is literally close to the beach. You, like, if, if you're into running or jogging, you can just, just run to the beach if you want to, man. And you'll be there in no time flat. It might not even be a workout. It's that close. Okay? Here go. You got a fan in your closet, man. So you know it's not a regular closet. It's a big closet. It's so big, she's using it as storage. Come on, man. And it got a TV in here. Hey, don't play yourself, man. We somewhere special right now. If you, like, like, if you, if you don't believe it, then you're delusional, right? You're transitioning to the carpet in this closet. Wow, this is a big closet. Hey, I can get, I can get my steps in easy. Hey, I know people's bedrooms are smaller than this closet, right? And it's like one big long hallway with a mirror. Hey, look, big of Sarah Lux, man. Look at my, look what she did to my shirts. I got so much merch now, it's not even crazy. I don't gotta wear anything else. I'm just wearing my own vibes, man. Hey, South Florida living. Hey, big up Raul Emil, man. That's my business partner. You already know what time it is, man. And make sure y'all tune in every week for that ride and talk every Friday at five o'clock, okay? Let's continue, man. So, you got a nice little foyer situation going into the bedroom. Look at this. Beautiful. Big tray ceiling, it's, it's the crown molding all around. Right? That's a, look, that's a king size bed. Look how big that is. I mean, look, but it looks small in here. But look how big the room is, man. They space floss and, and they, they took the absolute marble and absolutely brought it everywhere, which I like it. Hey, my name is Pierre Nicholson and I approve. Okay? Right? I'm loving the wallpaper. Liking the fan. Right? Come on, man, this got like a little bay window type effect, but the walls are just curving, but still give you the same effect. You got access to the pool, and she put the plantation shutters on the the the, the, the door leading to the outside, because it's all glass. Come on, impact windows, don't play yourself. It's not a regular one you can just smash. It's probably category four or five hurricane proof, right? And if it hits category four or five, come on, man, I'm out of here, all right? But that don't come around too often, check the facts. All right, beautiful. We're not gonna go upstairs yet because we still have to like go outside. Like, this is South Florida, most definitely, man. Sunshine State, and hey, let's check it out. Hey, when I say outdoor living down here is on the next level, there's nothing that compares to it. Hey, right down below, what compares to outdoor living in South, South Florida? Uh, there's gonna be a lot of nothing compares to it. I'm gonna go this way, all right? Let's continue, let's have a discussion, man, right? Beautiful, Hey, believe it or not, this is marble on the floor, and they matted it, so it's not slippery, right? We're here in the back lanai. I hope I didn't lock myself out. Okay, leave that open. Back lanai, look at this, you got fans here, right? You got lights, infrared lights. Look at this summer kitchen, man. You got slate right here, you got slate. This is a proper kitchen, this is concrete, right? Undermount sink, gooseneck faucet. You got your Lynx grill, come on, man. Hey, go Google, you know Lynx is not, hey, Lynx is top of the line. And guess what? You have soft clothes out here, man, right? You got fridges. Come on, man, that's how you're gonna be stocked, okay? Because, you know, every day is a hot day. You got fridge drawers. Okay, come on, man. Right? You gotta, come on, man. nice relaxing day. Soft clothes. Right, you got under the sink. You got stool area. And check out the peninsula, man. Let's count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Right? You got, now you can easily put, if you wanted to, you can put another chair right here and make it an even 10, you know what I'm saying? And guess what? Look how much more ceilings you have back here. 
Come on, man, this is crazy. And look at the backyard. Of course, you got boats passing by. This is crazy, big oversized pool. And this is gonna be a long video. Did I say that already? Yeah, I think I did, right? But you guys don't mind, because I'm giving you the business, right? Look at this. You guys see it now? Only 13 million! Hey, come on, I'm about to lose my mind, right? You got multiple seating out here. Do you think that you could entertain anybody here? <laughs> Hey, that was, uh, it was a question, but it's not a question at the same time. Don't play yourself, right? Big oversized pool. Hey, saltwater pool. Don't play yourself, man. Hey, we on a different level over here, right? You got a nice, ta they call it tanner pool. I call it lazy pool. Why you call it lazy pool, Pierre? Because you could just chill in there and get some of the water, but not get a full water. This looks like a turtle, but they, <laughs> this looks like a turtle, but you know, the owner making fun, right? So, this back here is your backyard, but it's a, also an easement for the Corps of Engineers, just in case, worst case scenario, it floods, they have access to do your, you know, to do your thing. But you see people put like volleyball nets, right? They, this person over there got a golf, golf, you know, golf course in their back, who got a golf course in their backyard? You know what I'm saying? If you tell somebody that, they'd be like, damn, Got a big backyard. Do you think, right? You got a balcony. This must be the master suite right here. And you got another master suite right here. This is crazy. Here we go a closet. So this is a closet for like for the boats and stuff. Look at this. So you got for the jet skis, you got your light jacket, you got skateboards, whatever have you, fishing lines, right? Big water, big um closet, right? You have access to the you know AC and stuff. And this right here is an easement. And with some of this is an easement. Right? And what I like about this easement is that you're not on top of your neighbors, man. Okay? Because trust me, man, in places of maybe south, south, little south and west Palm Beach, Fort Lauderdale, Miami, you know, the houses may, depending on what area, the houses may be closer together. Right? Let's walk this way. Come on, man. If you got a family. Your family could be out here playing all day. Look at the land space. This is absolutely crazy. Oh my word, but did I tell you that you somewhat have like a private beach? Come on, man, let's go and check it out right now, man. You know I'm giving you the goods, okay? Beautiful. I'm hearing music pumping. Come on, man. There go the causeway right there because you cross over the water. The beach is literally over there, right? We're in North Palm Beach. Beautiful. Let's go right here. Go to dock. Look at this. You got a beach in your backyard, man. So how do you access it? Some some of the residents actually, you know, you can walk right here or see where I'm walking, and they build a ladder and go down. And people take a ladder and go down, or you can build it off the side. You can go down and access this. Um, so you don't even have to go to the beach. You can come here and go and go to, and go to your own beach. Okay. Most definitely. Hey, my boy Raul was calling me. I can't take the call. I don't think you can see it. I can't take the call right now. Raul was calling me, right? That's my business partner, man. Most definitely. You let like, P show us the phone, but we couldn't see nothing. I'm sorry, right? Beautiful, right? So, look at this, man. So, there's a bridge over there, but that bridge lifts up. It opens up every half hour, right? So, if you go there, I don't think it opens up a half an hour later, but if it's on the half an hour where they open up, it'll open up instantly, Or but you gotta wait until it hits the half an hour point that they have the, I guess it's on a timer, right? Here go to the dock, and you got a Ford jet ski lift. Come on, man, in a place like this, man, you wanna be on jet skis. Hey, look at the property from the back, though. This is crazy. Okay, let's continue. Let's go. Let's go inside and let's go upstairs, man. Let's 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 see what it do. I didn't even get a chance to look at the one car garage, but I don't think it has access to the inside. I don't think I, I've seen the access. So you, I think it access from the outside. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna just hop over this gate because I'm tall enough to do that. Right, six feet. So I kind of do that. Look at this, man. Beautiful community. Literally, the the owner she's moving like over there. Building a brand new house. Here go another, like a, this is the type of boat you can have in the area. Look at this. Beautiful, man. Beautiful yacht coming down. That's the type of lifestyle over here, man. And it's beautiful community. Again, it was built by Toll Brothers, right? 
so you know the craftsmanship is like second to none, right? And the, you have some electric blinds over here, right? So when the when you see that sunset, look here, they got a boat. Beautiful, man. That's the type of vibes, man. Like you get here, all right? Let's go inside. You have the electric blinds right here. So when that western sun come down, you can kind of leave the western sun alone. And you can see your, your western sunset. Let's go, let's go upstairs right now. Okay, no, no problem, no problem. This is my good friend right here. Say what's up. What's up? <laughs> All right. Yeah, thank you, I appreciate you. Hey, let's go, let's go upstairs real quick. I dropped my paper. <clears throat> let's see, let's see what's, what's going on upstairs. Woo. Hey, we in, I forgot we're in winter time. I'm here sweating, this is crazy. All right, let's go upstairs. I'm loving the zebra print on the stairs. I'm loving the open railings. I'm loving the wood on the steps. I like how it curves around, okay? Look at that, look at the tray ceiling, circular tray as you go up, so it's playing on the circular steps, circular tray, it's all in one theme, man. Beautiful, man. Transitions to carpet up here. You got like a gallery of width type hallway, I like it. It's like a little vibe. Is, is that the master suite? Two master suites, five bedrooms and bathrooms. There's two master suites upstairs. So what's that downstairs? We've got two master suites and then two master bedrooms, they're calling them. But they're big bedrooms, big bathrooms. That one over there's amazing. Wow. Bedrooms all together. I, I'm gonna start right over here. <laughs> like, I, I don't know if I'm sweating because the house is that nice or it's hot. Uh, I'll leave that up to the viewers, okay? Beautiful, man. Here go AC. I'm thinking this house might be like four or five zones, AC zones. Yeah. It might be. Oh, this is, uh, Here go the elevator. Yeah. So we just looked at the elevator downstairs. This is where it comes up to, right? Yep. Beautiful. And another here's another closet. And look at this bedroom. I mean, my my son would love. It would be all over there. He right? would love his bedroom. <laughs> and just buy all over his friends. They would never they would never leave. Like honestly, they, they wouldn't. Right? Look at this. Wow. Like, as a kid, who, do, who does not like a bunk bed? My, my son calls it upstairs bed. Daddy, I love an upstairs bed, right? Look at this. This is crazy, like, sleep like, the, you know, and I want to be the type of person, well, I want to have the type of home where all the kids come to. That means I get to see my son all the time and know, and know that he's safe, you know what I'm saying? Who doesn't want that? Come on, if you're fat, it, it write down a P or I agree. Write that down in the comments, man. And let YouTube know that you're here. Like, we're not just here just throwing up videos and getting like one view, you know what I'm saying? Like, let YouTube know that we're relevant, okay? Look at this. Mediterranean top windows with the plantation shutters. Right, you don't need no side tables. Look, little kids type vibes. And I can see, like, up to being a teenager, there'll be, it's a very unique room. Very unique and it's done tastefully. Right? Uh, this is done very tastefully, man. And this is a straight up conversation piece as a kid. Going all the way up to like a teenager to young adolescence. Come on, man. Don't play yourself. Nice walk-in closet. Right? Let's go to the bathroom. You got a marble on the floor. And they did this bathroom right. Because they got the, the doors right here. So somebody can use the toilet. And the people still have access to the sink. Somebody can go take a shower. And if you really think about it, this is done to the 10th degree because usually when they separate it, they separate the toilet and the showers in one space, but they actually separate the toilet that can separate the shower. So you can take a shower and somebody can still use the toilet. You guys know what I mean, right? Somebody said it's a dovetail though. Don't play yourself. And the way they want to open it, you know that it's soft closed, right? Most definitely. Linen closet, right? Come on, man. Every Shower has that river stone. So you know, it's like very therapeutic on your feet. You think about river stones, you think about my, like hot stone massage type vibes, okay? Like spa, like, like spa, like spa bathrooms. They got a little green tint to it. All right, since so we're on this side. Let's go. Let's go in here. Beautiful, like a, oh wow. Hey, trust me, man. Like, here go another bunk, uh, bunk bedroom. This is more than great. Like, I ain't gonna lie to you. You gonna need a, like, if you, 
And if you got kids, you like this is absolutely or grandkids. If you got a lot of grandkids or kids, this is absolutely like the right house. Like it's a no-brainer to come buy this house. Hey, call me. Hey, call me right now. I know you see the number jumping up on the screen. If you got kids, like, I went to I went to a house that had a lot of bunk beds, but this is the most bunk bed I've seen in one house built in, man. Okay, beautiful crown mold and done to taste. Okay, I'll sleep, I'll sleep in this. <laughs> Wifey be like, hey, 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 don't play yourself. Okay, but it's that nice though. Okay. Um, let's go over here, and if you check it out, every bedroom is an en suite, okay? Beautiful, man, look at this. And I like how they separate the toilet and the shower, okay? Crown mode pocket doors, wow. Nice shower, I'm loving the tile. Come on, Riverstone goes again on the floor. You gotta see, I'm loving the circular glass tile. It looks like bubbles, right? And here we go, the linen closet. Hey, done tastefully, man. If you got a family, please contact me. I would love to see a wonderful family take this one right now, okay? Let's go into one of the master suites. So this, this house really got three master suites. Double door entry, let's walk up into it, man. Beautiful, man. Look at this, nice. Hey, I'm seeing all this, when I say green, it's like the Eastern color, and I'm seeing like a lot of Asian themes. Uh, green is like, a, it's like that jade look. Very lucky colors, man. And guess what, man? She like she knew what she was doing. Like she picked out like the best finishes. Like I'm, like everybody got their own taste. So you might have a particular taste. You might want to change two or three things. But as far as like the crown mold and all of that, you don't gotta do nothing with that, man. Like that is perfect. I love how it transitions to the tile in the bathroom. Under mount set. Look at the big frame mirror with a fixture, right, in the mirror. Nice walk-in closet, right? Beautiful, right? Come on, man. Here go the closet right here. Woo! Okay, and I'm getting my steps in today. And let me turn on the lights, come on, that's a violation. Like, the lights gotta be turned on, okay? We can't be looking at a dark house, don't play yourself, right? Come on, man, look at this. River stones on the floor. I'm very therapeutic. So every shower is like a spa type experience. Okay, and that's a deep niche, man. Come on, I gotta go in here. Look, look at this. Look how much you can put more stuff here. Come on, man. Deep niche. Some people have a niche in the shallow. You probably only fit two of those bottles, right? Here go the water closet. All right, crown molding. Let's continue. So this is a decent master suite. It got a little balcony. I'm getting other ones over there, so we say because that one got the big boy balcony. So we're gonna see what's the deal, right? Let's continue. Absolutely stunning. Let's go. You got like a gallery with hallway. You put Argo here, got a plug, right? Open rails, made the place feel down more open, right? You can see down from right here. Look at this. Beautiful, man. So when if you're keeping the function, you can make your grand entrance, right? Beautiful. So this, this house got two large rooms, right? This is like granite in here with the same type of treatment they're giving you downstairs with the, the hangers and stuff, right? So you can steam, right? Undermount set, gooseneck faucet, right? Let's continue this way, man. Very wide hallways, man. Two or three people go pass by at the same time. Here go another bedroom. I lost count. I think it's like 100 bedrooms, right? <laughs> like, okay, yeah. <laughs> she just gave me a nod. I gave you correct, right? Beautiful, my crown molding. Right? Nice. Beautiful, man. Done to taste. I think that's a clock right there. Like one of those digital clocks. Beautiful, man. Look at this. Right? Plantation shutters. You got your TV in every bathroom, man. You know? Beautiful. Plantation shutters. Nice walk in closet. Take it in, man. Done to taste. Over 10,000 square feet total. Oh my. Hey, listen, man. I'm getting my steps in, man. I'm glad. I'm glad I had the opportunity to do this house, man. Because I want y'all to see this and really love this house because it deserves to be loved on. And this house really deserves a good family to be in it, man. Or if you're a fan of having two rooms with a lot of bunk beds, man, this house for you, okay? 
So let's enter the main, main, main <laughs> master bedroom. Let's get into it, man. And, and guess what? I want y'all both to see which master bedroom y'all like the most. Have you ever seen a house with three master bedrooms? Right down below, man. Beautiful, man. Look at this. Crown molding. And listen, if you don't like the furniture, you could do your own vibe. Everybody got their own style. But this has a very homely, chic beach. If that makes sense. Chic, beach, homely. Like, you don't feel like it. The furniture does not feel like, oh, I can't touch it or it looks too expensive. Very comfortable, very homely. But it's very chic at the same time, man. Right? Look at this, man. Look how they space flossing on you, man. Beautiful. Hey, let's go outside to the balcony. I wonder if this is even open. If it's not, come on, man. So it's, it's nothing but a lock turn, right? Look at this. Look at the size of this balcony. Beautiful, man. And you come out here, and you just look at your beautiful property. Look at this. Wow, this is absolutely stunning. Look at the pool. Let's go back inside, man. I haven't done a long video like this in a long time, man. I haven't come by a house that's really like, that really captures my, like, that really captured the vibe. I don't say my attention, because a lot of beautiful comments, but it is so big that, wow. Like, I gotta investigate the whole vibe. And the plantation shutters, it actually slides into place. So you can put, you can put, you can, you know, line it up, and, it's, and you can just make it really dark, right? My wife would appreciate that actually. AC supply, AC return, right? Let's walk into the master bathroom. Beautiful, man. Hey, I'm loving the the, the jewelry on the like the handles. And you got an ottoman in your bathroom. Hey, come on, man. How many bathrooms you know have a has an ottoman? Double door entry going into the bathroom. Let's let's walk in slowly, man, because I'm the only one here, so I got my smelling salt. But if I faint, who's gonna who's gonna administer 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 it? Right? Loving the, the split vanities. Right? Look at this. You got your big jet tub. Right? Very black. Man, come on, man. I'm just picturing, close my eyes and picturing, like, the house got a, you know, imagine you could really fill up those bunk beds or at least halfway. This house just comes alive. Some about kids in the houses make it come alive. Like, there's nothing like it, trust me. I'm loving the, be the, the beach. <laughs> I'm loving the beach, but I'm loving the niche, right? I'm loving the, the seat in, right? And I like the way they split the shower heads. So two people come in here and shower at the same time, man. I like that vibes. And I'm assuming that the, yeah, that's right here. Okay, the, 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 to turn on the shower. Okay, let's go into the closet. Very big closet too, man. And can I, I, I say this every, every video that has a, a closet with a window. I love a closet with a window. There's nothing like a closet with a window to me, right? Beautiful. And usually this would be like an island, but they, they sunk it back here because you want that walkway space, right? Come on, man, who doesn't want to look at water, the, the water while they're, getting dressed right AC supply lines in here this big light in here that has in here just illuminating perfectly okay wow Th like this has been a wonderful treat man a wonderful treat most definitely okay and look man if you haven't already oh my god then you're crazy, man. Hey, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you can be notified every time I drop a new video. Trust me, you don't want to miss it. Hey, hit that subscribe button and then hit that bell. Don't play yourself, man. I know a lot of y'all come around, y'all watch anyway. If you're not subscribed, but you're watching. Come on, YouTube tell me everything. Okay, you know you know you want to know when I'm dropping because I'm dropping it consistently too. Don't play yourself. Okay, so hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. Also, if you want more information about this property or any other property down here in beautiful South Florida, anywhere in West Palm Beach, Fort Lauderdale, or Miami, give me a call, send me a text, send me an email. Even leave a comment down below and I'll be glad to help. Most definitely. Okay? And listen, man, the easiest way to 
schedule a call. It's going to the description. Click on schedule a call, man. Whether you want to buy or sell a house, okay? You see, the, you see our calendar. You see time and dates that's convenient to you. Okay, most definitely, because look, we like to schedule our calls out. Honestly, we're busy, but never be too busy for you. That's why we try to schedule the call so you get our full attention. We understand exactly what you want and go get it for you, man. Most definitely. Okay, and listen, thank y'all for rocking with me. I appreciate you like a thousand percent. I haven't had a long video like this in a long time. And honestly, I'm excited to deliver this video to you, man. Okay, thank y'all for rocking with me to the very end. I appreciate you like a thousand percent. You know, it's your favorite realtor down here in beautiful South Florida. Pierre Nicholson, till the next video. Peace. Fort Lauderdale and West Palm If I wanna home in South Florida Yeah, be here the real it is the one I hit up